So far in 2024, there's been nothing but firsts. Think about it. The first snowflakes have dropped from the sky. Parkside basketball has picked up their first couple wins of the season. And there are some critical achievements you're not going to want to miss. My name is Ethan Birch, and you are watching the Parkside Press Pass, powered by El Camino Kitchen. Parkside women's basketball bounced back and secured their first win of 2024 on Saturday against Wayne State on the road. The team was ignited by an electric 33-point first quarter. For the first time this season, Parkside had five players in double figures. Last night, Parkside down Benedictine 99-49. Here's some more firsts for you. It was the first time Parkside had both seven players in double figures and two players, Allie Hample and Lily Peterson, log double doubles in the same game for as long as our statistics database goes back. Well, I hope those first lives up to the hype. Parkside is 3-1 and one in conference play, and they head to Purdue Northwest on Saturday. On to the men's team. Parkside basketball swept SVSU and Wayne State. This past weekend, Colin O'Rourke continued his reign of dominance, averaging 17.5 points and 8 rebounds in the two games. The team shined defensively once again as they held opponents to under 60 points in now three consecutive games. Parkside is also 3-1 in GLIAC play, and they'll complete a long road trip this weekend at PNW. Now, I'm sure a ton of you were waiting for this news. Parkside Wrestling is back. It will be their first two matches of the new year, and both will be NSIC battles. First up is number 15 ranked Mary on Friday, and then Minot State on Saturday. Both will be played at De Simone Arena and will begin at 7 o'clock. For the first time this year, Parkside Track and Field will return to action. They will compete in the Firebird First Invitational this Saturday inside the Tarbell Athletic and Recreational Center. Are you curious about anything I might have forgot to mention? Well, no worries. Visit ParksideRangers.com for everything you need to know Parkside Rangers Athletics. Feeling hungry? Visit our friends at El Camino Kitchen near Highway 41 on 77th Street in Pleasant Prairie. This has been the Parkside Press Pass.